Martin Lab and Hair Alternative Heating Solutions. And some people keep having issues with burning their motors up if they have the smoke bypass. And I got the iPad here. Hopefully you can see that. But the stack temp right now is 317.8. Now, if you go ahead and run the bypass. Let's say it starts drawing live flame up through it. If it does. The new G's don't seem to be as bad about it. Opening's a little taller maybe, I don't know. But even with the bypass open and not actually pulling any flame through, yeah, 371. probably be going up here. There it is. Yeah, it's pulling a little bit of flame. Yeah, 446, 452, 454, 458. If you're pulling a lot of flame through, that's going to top out well over 500 in no time. Oh, there we go. Still going up. And I'm going to shut my bypass down now. I've not yet cooked the motor and I don't plan on starting. But even with the door shut, still going up. 600 degrees. It's just not designed to be a roaring flame or raging inferno bypass. It's a smoke bypass. And if you're getting that much flame when you're reloading, you're putting too much wood in. You can see now it's actually closed up and bypass is shut, it's dropping pretty quick. But you're not gonna have to do that very many times to just cook the bearings right out of the fan into the motor. This has been Martin Lappin of Alternative Heating Solutions. Uh, if you find our videos helpful or informative at all, please subscribe to our channel. And as always, if the women don't find you handsome, at least they can find you handy.